he was just like I thought he was going to be. He was pretty calm. Um, I know he was a little nervous first snap, but after that, you know, he was just um, he was pretty calm and played played really well. Um, it's probably a tough first start to play at the Horseshoe for the Big Ten Championship, and he stepped up and played really well. You talk, uh, on the TV, they were talking about his arm and showed it off a little bit with the, like that touchdown. Can you comment? And does he have a? Does he have a? You know, I guess a fastball. Oh yeah, he has some heat on that. Uh, yeah, he has, he has a good arm. He's throwing strikes out there, and yeah, he has. A good arm. Can you talk about uh, you guys? Receivers had like, five or six drops. Is that tough? I mean, can you just walk us through that? Is that how do you deal with that? Um, just, I think every game there's probably a drop or two, so um, as a receiver group, we just have to come, come on, just you know, concentrate harder and um, just work on it during practice. What do you, what do you say to Trey on the end of the toughest day? Um, just keep your head off. I mean, something you can do about it. Um, just get back on the practice field. After a tough loss like that last week, how do you guys stay focused for the Well, we still got a lot on the table right now, and we all know that. Um, I know we all know this game uh, is going to you know, affect our bowl situation, so we know we have to come out, and, and we just want we don't like losing. So. And what can we talk a little about uh, the Florida of Rosedale? Yeah, it's one of the trophy games, rivalry games, and you know, we take those seriously, and you know, we don't want to, we don't want to lose that trophy. Tony, uh, coach was just talking about how he felt getting to 10 wins would be very significant, and considering it's something that you guys haven't been able to do since you've been here, what would it mean to you know be able to go out in your senior season and get reach that double digit win by Uh That'd be awesome, especially on senior day. Um, I know there's only been like maybe five or five teams or so somewhere around there that's hit the 10 win margin and so that's pretty special and we have a chance to do that and so we just got to you know keep working hard in practice so we can do that. And do you just know no, about your last game at uh, Kinnick Stadium? Just been here the longest? And yeah, <laughs> uh, no, I haven't really thought about it yet. I'm sure I'll start thinking about it Friday, Saturday. What's it you know, mean for guys like you, Dave, Pat, uh, Raphael, that you know came in in five and you know have been here for five years and kind of been through a lot of ups and downs to so just be able to go out there this last time and look at, like you said so much at stake? Um, you know, it's exciting. We've been, like I said, we've been here for a long time, done a lot of hard work, and you know, Saturday's a big game, so it's going to be pretty exciting for all of us. Have you had a chance to reflect kind of on your tenure? Have any of those thoughts passed through your mind? Not, not really. Not, not yet, at least.